Greetings, Newsboy Legion. Now, there has been a recent Batman vs. Superman trailer that's been uh, released via Jimmy Kimmel Live, which apparently is now the place where you debut superhero movie trailers. And everybody's talking about it, of course. It's the third one. It's huge. It uh, uses a little more plot to it. And I'm going to be talking about it today, but I will not be discussing it in the same manner that I've been seeing everybody else to talk about it. Uh, namely, talking about if whether or not Lex Luthor, Lex Luthor is annoying, or if there's enough spikes on Doomsday's face. Because frankly, I don't care. I'm sorry, I don't. And I will say this in a nutshell. Uh, the trailer looks amazing. Uh, all three characters, it's great finally seeing the Holy Trinity in live action in one shot. Uh, it looks awesome, and I'm excited to see the film. Uh, I'm sold. I've been sold, but this double sold me, uh, if that's a thing. But that's not what I'm here to talk to you about today. What I'm talking to you about today is the the amount of trailers a large film tends to get, one of this size, is usually more than one. It usually gets three or four, and the plot can be a little bit spilled just by the nest if you just put together uh, the trailers. And I don't pay attention to any story leaks that come out in the press because I don't want to avoid that. You know, I just want to watch the official trailers from the studio, from the directors. And from these three trailers, I've been able to kind of deduce the uh, plot. And I'd like to come to you now and explain it. Uh, because, I don't know, I thought it would be interesting. All right. From what I've been able to see from these trailers, <clears throat> I think Batman vs. Superman Dawn of Justice is essentially this. Batman sees Superman saving the day uh, all the time and says to himself, Hey, how come everybody says he has a big dick? I have a bigger dick than he does. I have to take him out. And Lex Luthor sees Superman saving the day. And he says to himself, How come everybody says that he has a bigger dick than me? I have to take him out! And Superman, of course, reacts to this by going, are, are you kidding? You don't have bigger dicks than me. you got to step off. That's when Wonder Woman shows up and says, Look, no one cares about the size of your dicks. We have a monster to fight. The credits roll, and then Aquaman shows up and says, Hey, how come no one's talking about my dick? I have a, an erection fueled by the seven seas. The end. That's uh, the film that I see coming at you on screens everywhere. And I am really impressed, and I want to congratulate Zack Snyder for making a film adaptation of George Carlin's Bigger Dick Theory of War. Uh, I think this movie is going to be amazing and awesome, and we'll see how close my prediction is to the film uh, come this release date. I think it's in March or something like that, or in any way, early spring. So, I think that's it for now. Check out my links below if you want to support my Patreon or my books or whatever. And until next time, push the button, Lindsay.